Ladies and gentlemen, this is a four-way ladder match for the Battle Zone Heavyweight Championship. Introducing first from Mobile, Alabama, ladies and gentlemen, Michael Pettis. Standing in the corner to my left, he hails from Lafayette, Louisiana, he is the insane icon, Aston Beer. Standing mid-ring from Charleston, South Carolina, ladies and gentlemen, I give you the franchise, Chris Black. And being accompanied to the ring by Megan Moxley. From Swiss County, Mississippi, your current Battle Zone Heavyweight Champion, the Pharaoh of Fall. Now that you've all been blessed with the best ring announcing in the South, referee signals for the bell to start this contest. Joining at ringside is the bell ringer, Mama D herself. We're joined here by the king of security, Big Cat here. And it's good. It's Pendleton here in the ring. The Pharaoh, Michael Parrish, Ashes Pierce, Chris Black just wailing on each other. Coming in high, Chris Black getting called up. Buckle hard the franchise, Megan Moxley skirt ringside. Oh shoot, Black body drop, look at the speed going on in this match. Eating the candles on the outside, Michael Parrish, Pharaoh, bump dropping Chris Black. Going down to the canvas, going to the side, no, only striking. Mikey, I think he liked it. I'm going to try and catch my breath. I can't tell everybody what's going on. Right hands going on the ring. Chris Black Bear with Bunk teeing off with each other. Ash and Spears, Michael Parrish working on the outside here. Head button slamming him into the side apron. <laughs> nice boots over here, Michael Parrish. Bowling on the insane icon. Going back to the side. Third time to charm. Oh, oh! Dear God, I think I see a rip popped out of place here. Did anybody else see the momentum that Michael Parrish took that wall at? Fair Hunt, Chris Black taking him down in the ring. Catching him with a 
corner of the ladder, those sharp little points. Oh, man. Challenging him with the ladder. This is gonna be big. Oh, I can't stand to watch this. Dear God, there's a reason why he's the insane icon. And that was not the ladder coming into play in the ring. Barrow of Fox did not silly in the ring. Come on, Meg, if you need a safe place, you can come sit by me. It's okay. Come here, Meg. I'll take care of you. The bionic elbow by Chris Black to the Pharaoh of Fox. Catch the place, drops him down. Coming after the Funkster in the ring. Catching him. This one's not going to be pretty. Oh, dear Lord. There's your next step in this ladder match, ladies and gentlemen. And it's tattooed across the forehead of Ashton Spears. Michael Pear still recovered from having his ribs crushed between the ladder and the foot of the wall. Oh, right on the guardrails. Barrow and Ash Spears drop kick in the ring here. He has let up a top on the outside rat. Chris Black taking it to town. But young Michael Pears, who was definitely out of his elements. Come on, Megan, I'll keep you safe. I'll keep you safe. Come on, Megan, come on. Summer drop plunger. Shake of Eddie Guerrero. Love it. I see it saying I call ladies and gentlemen. It looks like parental advisor is in control of this match. This may be technically on paper a four-way letter match, but it's obviously two on two. This is for you, Max. BDT. The Pharaoh Funk is seeing purple and no, it's not just because his tassels are in his eyes. Got the belt hanging there above the ring. Ashton Spears ready to be battle's old heavyweight champion again. You like that, didn't you? Barrow Funk maybe not quite ready for Ashton Spears to climb up yet. That's what we call old insurance there. But you can't go for it unless you got the cojones. Here we go, a little bit out of there. Maybe we can reach that. Uh-oh. Barrow Funk catching him. Oh, dear Lord. Gun gunning him on the rope from off the ladder. You know you need that ladder in the ring to get the belt, right? Just saying. But Michael Pierce getting done over by the franchise here. Oh, that's a clothesline. Chris Black clothesline in the ring post here and tearing his shoulder. Chris Black having a history of shoulder problems for as long as I've known him. And that cannot be good. Oh, six stiff shots in the midsection here. Lord, did you hear the sound of that shot? Yeah. 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 Down he goes, throwing suplex in the ring by the Pharaoh. Ashton Spears going down. I don't know if I've ever seen Pharaoh hold a suplex like that for that long. Chris Black fed up with Michael Parrish's shenanigans out here. I don't know if you're choking him or pinning him, but either way, the ref's not going to do anything. And if you're choking him, that's so uncool. Uh-oh, and we've seen this one from the franchise before. You're gonna get kicked in the head. Kick his head off! Oh! His head is gone! Not like he used it for anything anyways. Chris Black strutting, sounding profile, and having the big old girl smiling at him. Oh, 
Let the professionals handle it in the ring, ladies and gentlemen. And I use ladies and gentlemen very loosely. Uh-oh, sitting him off the ropes. Here we come. Double close on down goes the insane icon. Taking back over, though, is the franchise, Chris Black. I kind of miss the loaded guns, Chris Black, but the franchise definitely works. Farrah Funk down on the canvas, so is Michael Parrish, this is all Chris Black and Ashton Spears now. Looking for some hardware here. Farrah Funk getting caught up in the ropes, twisting everything. Oh, Michael. Michael, baby boy. Welcome uh, to the main event. He may be completely unconscious. Security, keep him back. Well, this is all Chris Black right here in the ring. Chris Black, all you gotta do, grab that ladder, grab the belt, and you're the champion. Look at that shiner already popping up on the barrel of funk. Look at that. Michael Parrish. I, I. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm at a loss for words right now over the carnage. right now. The Pharaoh is definitely out of it in his head. Michael Parrish somehow. Take 
take him out. Ooh, good show, good show, Ashton. Hit him harder. Michael Pence started him back in the franchise. No reversing it. Oh my god! Ladies and gentlemen, 
Chris Black trying to get his hands on the belt, but fatigue on his body is a little bit too much to be able to reach up and grab it. So he's going to have to climb. Maybe he can find the fortitude somewhere deep down inside. Michael Parrish up to his feet. Chris Black getting his hand on that belt. Right hands by Parrish. Mama D almost can't watch this. Get the EMTs on the way. Even sleepy security guards awake for this one, ladies and gentlemen. That is a testament to what these two men are, these four men are doing in this ring. And the cutter down is Paris. every bit of finally crashing down to the floor Ashton Spears the insane icon Coach man please don't let Michael Parrish get back at this that kid's lucky he's not dead so this locker room is going to look like a World War II triop center Barrow with that shiner under his right eye can only see There are four coming back, stuck in the line. Play us call, down goes the ref. Oh, insurance to the Pharaoh Funk. It's a gun to the top of the ladder. Ladies and gentlemen, you see Pharaoh Funk with the belt in hand. He's taking out the Pharaoh, making him eat his own belt. These two men fight on the belt. We know the match is decided, but the referee's got to be the one to get the signal. If the referee... Ring the bell, the referee has declared Ashton Spears the winner by virtue of seeing him with the belt. The player grabs the belt, but the referee didn't see it.
it up. Technically, everybody's seen in this building. Who won? Michael. You got 100% of my respect, pimp. 100%. He got in here. He got broken half. But by God, we got the job done. That's right. Let me explain something to Chris Black. Ashton Spears and Max Maverick. Black out, step back out here. I may, my face may be swollen off my head. Michael may be broken half. And this man may be rusty coming off a of vacation. But the way I see it, there's three of them and there's three of us. And I know that these two has got just as much heart in them as I do. So who's willing to show back up next Saturday night and watch us kick some ass in an outlaw kind of way? jumped the rail tonight because they were doing something that you taught me that was not right. But I can't help you out of this one, Faye Rose. I come in here, I bought my ticket, I done what I thought was right, my family taught me it was right, you taught me it was right, everybody taught me it was right. But it's going to have to be you and Michael against whoever they want. To be. If I want anybody to God me fighting, it's going to be you. You hear me? I'll tell you what, there's ain't one thing left to do is go put some ice on this damn thing. Bandage you up Saturday night. I'm fixing to teach you how me and McGee get funky.